I think we're going to start to see a little bit of a plateau of, of, of new, new operating system technologies and so forth. But what we will see predominantly is an increased fragmentation of the market. I think a lot of observers are really hoping that fragmentation um, goes away. I actually think it's going to become even worse than it is now. If you take Android, for example, in the Android marketplace, uh, the, the device ecosystem for Android devices, uh, the developer ecosystem, it's very fragmented, uh, regardless of what Google says to the contrary. Uh, um, developers tell me constantly that, that they struggle with getting their apps to work on all devices. We hear from end users very consistently that um, they don't know whether or not an app is going to work on their device or not. Um, and the, the dynamics of the device manufacturers, the OEMs, and the mobile operators are such that they're incented to continue to fa fragment that. Um, and I don't think Google can get their uh, get that, that camel's nose out from underneath the tent, as it were. Um, so I think that's a major trend we'll see. And it's not just around Android. Um, uh, it, 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 it's, it, it, it's across the other smartphones as well, where you'll see uh, just continued variety. I think the, the primary reason that Google has been so successful with Android to date is the, the model that they created has very little friction for both the carriers and the device manufacturers. The, because it was never really clear what Google wanted to get out of doing Android, they built it in such a way that, that it could be, it could be uh, modified and taken in all sorts of directions. It's an a la carte, um, uh, very flexible offering. And, um, and so anything that a mobile operator asked for, they could do. It's free and it's, an, it's open and there's APIs for it. And I can modify it, I can fork the code. Same thing with the device manufacturers. They can put their own, own UI on it. They can add all the little apps they want um, and, and different experiences with no friction. Um, and so that didn't really exist before um, in the ecosystem. I think that, that's, that, that, that Android ends up being very good for the mobile operator, the device manufacturers, but at the end of the day, I think that the user experience that we all really want to have on our phones and we want our family members to have is suffering because of that, and that's just my, my personal opinion. Um, and, and it's why I, I, I personally am disappointed that Google's doing so well in this, um, because I think it's a detriment to us having um, uh, a really, really easy to use user experience. For example, I would never recommend any Android phone to a non-technical person. I just wouldn't. I, I think it's, it, is, uh, it has too many bells and whistles, there's too many um, uh, knobs, too many things that people have to manage. And a non-technical consumer, while, while they want to have flexibility and customization, they don't want to manage their phone. They just want to use it. I think the biggest question that's not being asked about mobile operating systems right now is why are we wasting all of our energy, we being the industry, on, uh, on building them at all? The reality is, is iOS, Android, Windows Phone, the BlackBerry operators, they're all fundamentally the same. They really are. The differences between them, given, um, uh, given what they do, is very minimal. And we are wasting an inordinate amount of energy as an industry. Um, competing at something which is really no longer that important. We should be spending our time delivering end-user value through the creation of powerful cloud services that are available on every device. It's clear that that's what consumers want. They want to experience their, their services on all the devices they have. And they don't want to be tied to a, to a specific device. All of these operating systems are fundamentally the same. They really are the, the same technology stack. And I think it's a, it's a, it's a, uh, an a, sh a shame that uh, so much energy is in being invested um, on that versus the real value.